Hey guys, I just wanted to let you know that the wife and I successfully made it to Walmart today and after uh, negotiating with three people all the way up to the assistant manager, uh, finally was able to convince them that they could sell me this damn thing and that they wouldn't get in trouble. Um, they had a slew of them in the back, uh, but they said that they were saving them for Black Friday. And, you know, we went through the routine and uh, I finally convinced the assistant manager to just scan the damn thing and see if he could sell it. And he finally agreed and I found myself walking out with one. So, uh, so far, we I literally just put it together. The wife just played her first game um, and everything on the counter seemed great, except for there are some scuffs on the control panel that I will have to um, make a complaint about. Um, you can't see them very well in this lighting, but where this scuff is, there's actually a huge, what looks like a gash in the right light. And then there's a nice chunk taken out there. Um, other than that, the screen is in great condition. Uh, everything seems to be working properly. The joystick uh, is a four-way joystick, hallelujah. And uh, the wife says that uh, it responds well in her first game. Um, she's going to have to get back in the zone and we'll be competing for high scores. Up here we got our little uh, Hester Arcade scoreboard uh, for some games that we play more often than others and some of our scores. We're not good at any of these, but we're, we're working on it. We're getting better. We're having a great time with these machines. Uh, there's the Asteroid Centipede 12 and 1. Uh, they were out of risers, so I had to put the Rampage cabinet. He's just hanging out over here without a riser, still waiting on his gauntlet fix, which they've supposedly sent. Um, but yeah, uh, there's Yoshi the Bow Dog. Hey, Yoshi. Hi. How are you? Okay, so... Anyways, just wanted to let you guys know that uh, we acquired the Pac-Man cabinet, and you can too if you want to put a little work into it. Um, I did notice, um, and somebody else mentioned this too, I think it was Benjamin Deadmoon, um, shout out to fellow new YouTuber. Um, he was talking about how his screen, and I seem to have the same thing uh, from, from viewing angles, is not as clear as, like say, the, the 12 in one or the Rampage when you get at an angle. And, my theory is, is this a monitor that is technically on its side so that when we're moving left and right, from the monitor's perspective, we're actually moving up and down and that might be why the viewing angles are slightly off. Um, it doesn't bother me when you're in front of it. It looks great. Um, so I don't know that I'll complain about that. I just want, I just want a new control panel. Uh, with better that, that's not scuffed up with a nice overlay so I can protect it. Um, so yeah, any questions, let me know. Sorry I haven't posted in a while, but been working on trying to make this happen and um, been busy working, doing other life things. Well, what's that? What's that look? Oh, I was just listening. Just listening? Know. Okay. Um, what do you want to say? That it is really loud. So we're it gonna is have super to like, loud. figure out a way to kind of dampen it without making it sound like it's out of a can. But like, that's the medium volume. That's, yes. yeah. it, that's one thing I've noticed with these cabinets is they seem to have varying levels of volume output. The, the Rampage cabinet is loud, although maybe not quite as loud as the Pac-Man. Uh, the Asteroid Centipede cabinet is pretty quiet and totally fine on a lower level. Um, although it doesn't get super loud. And then the Pac-Man cabinet is, is really loud, even on the low settings. So not sure how they calibrate those or if there's you know any way to really do much about that. Of course, we're just gonna find something to put over the speaker to, to dampen it a little bit uh, so we're not blown away. But I would rather have it be too loud than too quiet because we can make it more quiet ourselves, uh, but there's no way for us to really make it louder. Um, so yeah. Been loving these machines. I know they're not perfect. Um, I know peop some people have, you know, arguments over whether these things are 
worth the money or not, or if they're garbage or trash. And I like looking at them. I like sitting at them. My wife and I are having a blast. We just got new bar stools. We got bar stools. These bar stools are 29 inch bar stools and they are perfect when you're on the rise, when the cabinets on the rise or. You can um, pick them up for 20 bucks at Walmart when you're there getting your Pac-Man cabinet. That's, that's true. Uh, that's what we did. Um, as you can see, we've put some some stickers on our on our risers down here just to, for a little personality. I wouldn't put ca ca uh, that stickers on the actual cabinets, but it's on the riser. I think it's kind of fun and cool and um, yeah. Uh, all right, guys. Any questions? Let me know. I'll try and post more videos. Um, and shout out to all my arcade one up. Uh, community members and uh, alright talk to you later bye bye